there, welcome back to my channel. I hope you had a great Easter break. My, mine was really amazing, very tiring. But today I'm going to be talking about my research trip to Devon with my university, uh, which was truly amazing. There are approximately 120 students that came on this research trip, all coming from different backgrounds, from zoology to ecology. Uh, it was really amazing because we had great big chalets and we just had a hot tub, like a re it was really, really nice. The place that we stayed at, uh, also had like a jacuzzi, swimming pool, uh, so that was a real treat. But it wasn't really just fun and games, you know, we did do some serious stuff down. We did many things in Devon from looking at uh, mollusk behaviour on the beach to um, behaviour of some songbirds in their territories, um, to goat vigilance in the Valley of the Rocks, and we also looked at the wood flora in Badgeworthy. So yeah, it was really cool to look at these different surveying techniques and how we can actually use them for our jobs. Um, once we finish university, but after all the 6am wake ups, we were really drained as soon as we got back to Cambridge. So yeah, it wasn't just like, so you think of serving as just like sitting down, not really doing anything, but we really had to like, um, we, we did a, a large amount of walking, we walked for miles, well, I don't know about, well, we walked a fair amount, let's say that, up big hills and into different, quite hard to reach areas, which most of the public don't go to. So after that very tiring experience, it was definitely worth it, and I do recommend people go to these areas in Devon as well. Yeah. Hello, Alex. Yeah. It does look like so much It's the step over the gap that's the hardest part. Oh Stop being a chicken! <laughs> <laughs> should we should we take a picture of the <laughs> Oh my god. Gonna climb to the top of the mountain. <laughs> sing, no. sing. No. Sing. I'm not a singer. Well, we can safely say that's a female. To be fair, we're supposed to be 25 minutes away from them. They don't really seem that bothered by us, do they? So. Can I get clues? Yeah, this one is the one that's right at the top. I hate you, you can see me 
Let me see if I'm... See, I was right. Can you put your stupid recorder on? No. Uh. It's so beautiful. Hello. <laughs> yeah. As always. You just tripped. Hi. I didn't trip. Oh, good old Rio. Hi. <laughs> Maybe it's not the toad. Maybe it is. It is a toad. It is a toad, yeah. Yeah, it's a yeah, bumpy yeah, back. Yeah. You're supposed to walk. Gold rim around the eye. Yeah. yeah. What do you think? Three canopies. Is that that one? Yeah, this is where we need a camera in each group and you lie your face your camera. All right data for the right station. So, here on the actual we're probably, we're probably three or four? Yeah, I'd say that you have around the three or four more. First one would have been a two, I reckon. Yeah. Okay. How are you doing? Yeah, we've got two of Yeah, so your, your next station is the one. So. Can I go like that? Oh, yeah, then, yeah. yeah. I went, um, like are we training it for my I hope you enjoyed those videos. Don't forget to subscribe. Um, I've got videos coming up soon of um, of looking at different zoos. Uh, I've got videos uh, of ZSL, uh, Appenkuhl, Amersfoort, Rotterdam, and Burger Zoo, uh, which are all very, very different and really, really amazing.